Oh my God. Okay. Uh, good morning. Hi. Welcome. Um, it's Quinn. <laughs> it is we're Sunday. I think. What about what is? I don't even know what day today is. It's a Sunday. I'm hanging out in the ferry terminal lineup. We are about to head over to Vancouver. This is kind of an interesting trip. I don't know what's happening. Um, what I mean by that is we are doing a bit of a job interview. So I had a couple guys contact me and say, I would like to start a drift school. And I'm like, yeah, I want to start a drift school too. And they're like, we want to do that thing as well. And by the way, we have a, a special guest coming over and helping us build a car. So can you come over, help us build the car? Or maybe that's their plan. I don't know exactly. Uh, but meet with our special guest and then hang out with us and propose a drift school. And so I'm very excited by this. Uh, that's why I'm recording this. Hi. Um, but it's weird. It's strange. I don't know what's happening. Behind me, I have a little bit of special cargo. Let's take a look at that special cargo while we got a chance. So, yeah, it says performance wheels. Australia. We peek in here. We actually have a little special gift here. Dun, 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 from the people at... Staples, and check this out. Supatsuland, Vancouver. And so um, I'm proposing a dress school with them, uh, but not just a dress school, uh, one that is more encompassing of all performance driving. And it happens to include drifting as a big primary chunk. Uh, behind that though, you're gonna see a couple other things. We got a couple gifts for our special guests. So, I, yeah, ah, help, mom, help. Edit this out. No, I can't get the box to balance. There we go. Nervous, 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 nervous. And you're like, well, no, my balance, no. It's like, no, we can do it, we can do it. We're balancing, we're balancing. There we go. Under here, we have a very special, ta -ta. I bet you didn't know I had those. We are, we've arrived in Vancouver. We're here now, Ben is with us. Ta-da! Uh, he's got a very rare Speed Hero uh, sweater with no zipper. He's the guy that won that. So, ta-da! Thank you very much, Quinn. I really appreciate winning <laughs> it. I'm so happy I wear it all the time. He's looking at this, but I'm right over here, so I saw that. How nervous are you? What number out of 10? I am so, I'm like a six out of 10 because if this track is a real thing it's gonna like change british columbia motorsports hey that's a good reason okay let's do that uh see you soon i was laying back in the violet patch on the blanket watching the pilot crash Stinging back as to douse the flames Then I drank it Wine flowing out of the tanks Cold flames from the top of the cliff I knocked into Bo who was rocking the rift Light beams coming out of my eyes Height screams drumming up a surprise uh, Day one is sort of complete. We're gonna go see Justin. Justin is gonna house us for the evening. Uh, ben and I, uh, we put out a pitch. Um, what we'll, we'll summarize it as a seed is planted. To, to grow a beautiful flower, you need to plant a seed. Uh, but sometimes it takes time. Yeah, and sometimes it takes a little bit of fertilizer and a little bit of, a little bit of water and a little bit of vision. <laughs> yeah. And so, Sometimes you need to plant many seeds, and only some of them will germinate. So <laughs> we're talking to as many people as we can about the idea and see who it sticks with. Probably not who we expected it to. Lay off your piece, yeah. They're excited. There we go. <laughs> Jeez, I want to see the V-shapes, because those ones are my favorite. You can. <laughs> dun, 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 dun. He got things for making things. Yeah. Oh, he's right in. He's just clawing at it. Like, yep. oh my god, let me at him. Yep. Yeah. Cool. Okay, one second. I'm going to move these out of the way. Ah! Ah, my real world sticker. So pretty. My rough world sticker. There we go. Oh, yeah, protect the stickers. That's the thing. You can touch, you can play. All right. He's excited. Look at the specs. 
Uh, yes. Height is five. Uh, 15 by 10 minus, I don't know. Yeah, I was going to say. No, no, look at the back and then tell me. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. So they're like, they're like minus 50 plus, like. Yeah, geez, those are Yeah. Da -da -da. They're excited they're playing. We're at, we're at, we're at Justin's house. Uh, Keith is joining us. Hi. There you go. You're, you're <laughs> a, bu <laughs> a bunch of middle-aged men play with metal in a, <laughs> in a basement. It's what in a basement. we like. <laughs> it's the things we enjoy. <laughs> but, uh, so yeah, this is where we're staying tonight. This gentleman was very nice of us to stay here, so this is good. <laughs> so good morning, this is day two. Uh, that's, that's Ben. Uh, he's wandering up to speak to a lovely lady who called us randomly about a car for sale. Uh, his dad's got one of these, and so this is a manual one versus his father's one. Now in Canada, you will get a discount on your electric car if you crush an automobile in its place. And so his dad has the exact same car, probably just as rusty, uh, but not manual. This one is manual. And so the idea is to swap this one with his dad's car and crush the automatic one instead. Everything is fake. Oh, it's so good. The Honda Acti across the top. This is exceptional. Wonderful. Wonderful, wonderful. We've got our interior alligator. It's great. It's wonderful. Yeah. So Quinn, tell me about your rat world experience. Uh, we ran a fake Vice article, which I really wish we were recording over there. I don't like the audio would have turned out. There is a group of people that not only follow, like just in a general sense of like, pay attention to the Rowell builds, but they physically fly from country to country and like city to city to help build the cars. And I think it's at their own cost. Yeah, which I is so. yeah, which is exceptional. I think that is a beautiful community. Uh, it is a surprising community, but also not surprising in a weird way. Yeah, uh, we didn't get a chance to meet Makai, but we also sort of interrupted the middle of the build, so we really didn't want to actually truly interrupt. If that makes sense. Yeah. yeah. And perhaps we could have stuck around for dinner or something, or uh, yeah. hung out longer but the island is calling for me very much so yeah that it is an exhausting atmosphere very quickly uh we're about to adventure actually uh, i'm very excited about our next part of our adventure the adventure isn't return you're like I, you're watching this you're like ah yeah i'm going back they're going back to the island cool i'll turn the no no hold up we're gonna go do something cool I am stoked. So if you don't know what this is, this is an Electrica, Electrica Mechanica Solo. It is a three-wheeled automobile. I think it's two-seater. It might be only a single. But hi, welcome. Thank you, guys. Ta -da. Oh, he's got the Mechanica. Oh, look at this. Top sports. They're very neat. Ta-da. Solos. There's a bunch over there, too. There are a bunch. Yeah. I recently stumbled across three-wheel electric yeah. car companies all the time. <laughs> You can bump height and wire loud And keep your arms folded and fire loud Now I'm out diving off the ledge for the pearls Thunderclap rapping at the edge of the world When the clock, clock struck, struck twelve I was delving in that realm When the clock, clock struck Little, like, you got your little lion that's around. This is amazing. Jeez. 
Get in there. You hear that? Are you sure? You can they both beat in? <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> Neat. No, this is exceptionally cool. I am very impressed with this. Uh, are we a uh, lithium ion? Are we, uh, yes. Okay. more stoked about this than a real welfare. I hate to say it, but I am. I, I get it. <laughs> yeah. Can we sh make sure to show all the... All the... There's also a Twizzy. Did you get excited about the Twizzy? What do, I don't know about the Twizzy. I've seen the Twizzy. But this is a Renault? It is a Renault. Oh my god, this is actually a Renault Twizzy? Yeah. Holy shit. Why? Ow. I For actually, purposes? I don't actually know how it's here. Yeah. I don't know how it's legal. I don't know either because it's not 15 years it's old. It's not 15 years old. This is like. If I were to document how I feel right now, how would I document how I feel? I feel a little bit kind of fat and old. <laughs> I feel a little bit um, low energy and exhausted. And I feel a little, a little, oh my God, I feel a little late to the game in, in most of the stuff. That being said, I also know that I'm more qualified than basically anybody to do uh, such a project. So. I have some benefits and I have some negatives if I were to record that. Um, I'm an exceptionally good teacher. I'm pretty good at, at being a public out figure if I need to talk to a big group of people. But at the same time, I feel really fatigued and I feel really slow and I feel lethargic and I don't feel strong and confident like I used to. So those are kind of the things I got to balance this weekend. Um, I'm actually really worried about a conflict of lifestyle. So. I am a person who likes to spend as little as possible. I like to live as minimally as possible and I don't really like to lavish myself with nice stuff. For some people that is cool, they think that's great. And for other people, they might think that that is uh, maybe boring or maybe I lack confidence. And so some of the people I'm hanging out with this weekend might live a different lifestyle. And I'm worried that I need to sort of mesh with these people to follow like the dream of a, a drift school or to attract them to my personality to lead the way to a drift school. And so there might be a bit of a conflict. One of the benefits is that a fellow named Ben, he's one of our patrons. He's gonna be uh, meeting me on the other side at Sawasan. He's a friend of the person that is running this sort of gathering and job interview. So he's gonna escort me. And I think he's a little bit more on my side when it comes to the, the finances of life and the lifestyle around that. So I have that benefit as well. So it's really nice of him. He's the one who sort of hooked this up. So Ben, thank you very much. Um, yeah, I'm going to get all this out and this might, we'll maybe even chop a bunch of this out. Who knows? But it is uh, exciting and strange and weird and I'm nervous and I'm scared. I'm allowed to be scared. I'm allowed to be scared, I think. <laughs> yeah, it's weird. Anyways, that's kind of our update. We're hanging out at the ferry. We've got our wheels to take over with us. We've got our proposal. Uh, I borrowed this truck. It's too big of a truck. <laughs> it's a good truck. It's a it's a reliable truck. It's maybe too big for my purposes, but it's what I got. So I'm going to work with it. Um, so it was very nice of Mr. Joel Fox to lend me his truck. I like this. 
and yeah, we'll head over. We'll see how things go. I'm scared. Okay. Um, talk to you later. Bye.